the inquirer will pick a category, they'll touch uh, through a touch screen, and the category goes over um, to the respondent on the other side. The respondent is not really gonna respond verbally. Instead, it's just gonna be looking at yes or no labels on a big computer screen. And this will be sufficient uh, for brain patterns that are different and are associated to yes and no to be detected by an EEG system that is placed on top of the respondent's head. On the other side, what the inquirer then does is waits for some brain stimulation, information that's transmitted through um, the internet and actually results in the activation of our transcranial magnetic stimulation coil. Their job then is to report whether an or not they saw a flash of light. And if they saw a flash of light, that indicates a yes answer. So they use that to continue problem solving and trying to figure out which item in the category um, the respondent is seeing. The subject is selecting a category. She picked food. Now she sees the possible answers and asked, is it a liquid? The respondent knows which food it is and is answering the yes or no question as to whether or not it's a liquid. You can see the cursor moving toward the answer that the respondent is focusing on. And the computer has decided whether the answer is yes or no. Now the stimulation is being delivered to the inquirer. The respondent's answering the question is the food item served cold and the stimulation has been sent with the corresponding answer. The final question the inquirer picked is, is it sweet? And the computer has decided and sent the stimulation to the inquirer.